Hi everyone, Dr. Nicole here. So today I want to talk about a dental cleaning and why a dental cleaning is way more involved than just getting your teeth cleaned. We are actually doing a check of all the different areas that make you truly healthy in your mouth. We like to consider it more of a wellness check than actually just having a cleaning. When people come to the dentist, they think about teeth. Obviously you should, we are the teeth people but the teeth are attached to bones, which are attached to muscles, which are attached to joints, and the rest of your body. So if we limit looking in your mouth at just your teeth, we're missing a lot of other stuff and that makes you truly, truly healthy. So what I've done is I try to separate oral health into three different areas. The first one is the healthy foundation, and the healthy foundation is exactly what you think of when you come for your cleaning. You think cavities, you think gum disease, you think root canals, you think crowns, you think fillings, all of those wonderful things, okay? The second one is the chewing system. And this is more involved and more body focused. It's not just on the teeth. This is how your teeth come together, your jaw joints, your bite, your smile. If you have any worn teeth, how your teeth come together, all of those wonderful things, okay? And last but not least, which is probably the most undervalued but very important part is your healthy self. And that is how your body affects your oral health. These things include the medications that you're taking, what you're eating, your nutrition, and your stress level, okay? So all three of those things make you truly, truly healthy. So during our wellness check, what we're actually doing is we're evaluating you in all three of these areas to see how healthy you are. So let's go take a look and let's figure out why a dental cleaning is way more than just scrubbing your teeth. The first step of our wellness check is for Sarah to check in and see how you are doing. She's gonna ask how you're feeling. She will ask if you've had any changes in your medications, your medical history, etc. Next, we'll ask to see if you're having any oral issues. What do I mean by this? If you're having any issues with your teeth, any broken fillings, any sores, anything that you can think of in your mouth. Next, we will check the teeth. This is when we're definitely checking the foundation and the chewing system. We're looking for wear, we're looking for broken fillings, we're looking for cavities, we're looking for defects in the teeth and how they come together. If the soft tissue and teeth look healthy, we then go on and check your gums. This is everybody's favorite part, when we do the probings to see how deep the pockets are. We would like your pockets to be between one and three millimeters. This is considered healthy. In addition to checking the pockets, Sarah will also check your plaque-free and bleeding-free scores. We want these to be above 95%. Once we know how your gum health is and your tooth and soft tissue health is as well, we then move on to showing you how to make yourself healthier. What Sarah will do is she will put pink dye onto the teeth. This dye is actually made of beet juice and it shows where plaque and bleeding are occurring in your mouth. From this, she will then go through how to properly remove plaque from the teeth. I don't know about you, but I was not born knowing how to properly brush my teeth. So just a little bit of help can bring you a long way. Finally, after the soft tissue check, the tooth check, the gum check, the oral hygiene instructions, then we finally do our dental cleaning. This dental cleaning is split into two uh, types. The first one is that we use the ultrasonic scaler. The ultrasonic scaler uses water and ultrasonic vibration to remove debris from the teeth. It allows us to no longer have to scrape the teeth as we have all had done in the past. Okay. Once the ultrasonic has been used, then Sarah will go through and use the typical dental tools to remove the remaining stuff on the teeth. Please remember, the less stuff you show up with, the less stuff that has to be removed, which means less stuff, less scraping. Next, we will do what we call the final buff. This is everybody's favorite because this is when we make your smile sparkle. What we do is we use a little spinning brush head with some toothpaste. What it does is it removes all of the tea stain, coffee stain, wine stain, the, the pink stuff that we use during the cleaning, all of that gets removed to really, really make you shine. 
Last but not least, after all of those other steps, is that we will floss. During the step, Sarah will use regular dental floss to remove anything that's remaining in between your teeth and really make you feel good. As you can see, a wellness check is way more than a dental cleaning. Each step seems quick and easy, but that is because you are healthy. The faster it goes, the healthier you are. Please remember that we are actually checking all three areas of your health, your healthy foundation, your healthy chewing system, and your healthy self every time you come in for your wellness evaluation. If you have any questions or would like to talk to me further, please feel free to give us a call. But until then, keep on brushing.